Number 36, State versus Rossi. 6768. Are you Mr. Rossi? Are you Mr. Rossi? Is that a yes? I'm having a hard time. I um, I think I'm going to have to have the jail restate what he said. I'm having a really hard time hearing him. What is it? My name is Alton Knight. He says his name is Arthur Knight um, Brown. Alton Knight Brown. Right. I can't hear. We want to have him state his name and date. Yeah, of birth. we can't hear him at all. Can you ask him? Can you please state your name and date of birth? Here, get a little closer. Lady, my name is Arthur Knight Brain. My date of birth is 22nd of the 11th, 1986. Hmm. Okay, I don't. I think we're having a. Uh a problem with understanding who this person is i don't this is not number 36. your honor we've got him as nicholas rossi but he's saying his name is arthur knight brown no that's one of the aka's it that's looks my, like that's your birthday? Um, we're having a really really is it July 11th, 1987? No, lady, it's 22nd of November, 1986. 22nd of November, 1986. Yes, ma'am. Your Honor, Tamara Vasquez for the state. Um, this individual has been extradited um, and he has not admitted his name or birth date accurately and so. I don't Objection think we're going to be successful on that today either. It's a also Objection, known as. Objection, my lady. That is complete hearsay. And I would ask uh, your ladyship that the prosecution to cause for why uh, they uh, 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 proceeded so, to. So, Mr. 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 Knight, Mr. Knight. I'm going to whilst I had an appeal pending in the Supreme Court. Mr. Knight, I'm going to appoint a lawyer for you. There's a no bail warrant in this case, so we're going to set it for a detention hearing in 10 days. And I'm also ordering that you not have any contact. And if we can have the, it, the alleged victim's name protected. Oh, okay. Well, how was he supposed to know who not to have any contact with? We're going to have to get the no contact order form given to him personally. Okay. All right. So I am ordering that you not have any contact with the person who's going to remain confidential until you get a copy of the no contact order. So hopefully that makes sense. And when you get the order, you can see who it is. Um, I'm also ordering that you be given a copy of your charge. It is a first degree felony from November 1st, 2008. Yes. From November 1st, 2008. So you'll get a copy of that. Your next hearing will be in front of Judge Lawrence. Um, January 26th at 1 o'clock. January 26th. One o'clock, Judge Lawrence, and that will be a detention hearing. Uh, Your Honor, before we go, would the court ask uh, the bailiff if defendant has been fingerprinted and photographed as part of being booked under this OTN number? I'm not sure, but if the court will, if the court will uh, send notification to our records department, they can follow up, and make sure it's been done. Okay, I will uh, make that order. Lady, I am um, ordering that he be fingerprinted and photographed. Thank you. Okay, Mr. Knight, we're hey, finished. I have, I have an attorney, Lance Bastion. Lance Bastion. Okay, 
Well, your mind. attorney can show up at the next hearing he wasn't, and then we'll vacate the appointment of a legal defender. We haven't been notified of any hearing. Next Judge, we'll give him the information he can relate to his attorney about the next Thank hearing. You. Thank you. Thank you, next, Your Honor. Have a good day. Bye. Next is number 24, State versus Markley.